What is Trade-Based Money Laundering TBML. Money laundering, as the name suggests, is a process by which dirty money or black money enters the legal and legitimate financial system in such a way that it cannot be distinguished from legal money, thus becoming clean or laundered money. When international trade is used to launder such money, it's called trade-based money laundering. This is usually done by misrepresenting the price, quantity or quality of imports or exports. For example, a company A in the USA sends 1 million widgets of $2 each to another company B in Mexico. But, while preparing the invoice, company A does under invoicing below the fair market price and mentions the price of each widget as $1. Thus, on paper, the price of the trade is declared as $1 million. Now, Company B in Mexico can sell the widgets in the open market at at least $2 each and in the process can make $2 million, which means an extra $1 million. Company B now has the option of layering and integrating this money in the legal money system or give a share of this illegal money to Company A or fund criminals and terrorist organizations. This is an example of how trade-based money laundering works using under-invoicing. There are similar methods, like over-invoicing, multiple invoicing, short shipping, etc. Some of the red flags of TBML are Requests that do not seem to make commercial sense, such as selling goods at well below market price. Invoice showing other or undefined charges as being greater than a percentage variance of the total transaction value. The involvement of third parties. If the customer is acting for someone else, then the bank needs to know who they are and be satisfied that they are bona fide. Illogical transactions. For example, why would a company selling electronic goods from China to the USA suddenly want to ship an expensive car to Colombia? These are just some of the TBML red flags. For our international trade finance and payments related courses, check out the description below.